Hey what's up YouTube this is Pranav Nambiar your host and today I am going to update the earlier method the method which I told you 5 months back uh, to solve the Windows 10 Dolby problem and thank you guys because I got a really good good watch time and good views on this on this particular video that is 3630 views and I am going to update this method so this method used to work before the Windows 10 Creators update but now after the Windows 10 Creators update this method just doesn't work so just, I found a new method for this. It's a new method, it's a reliable method and it works like a charm for me. But guys, you can also watch the earlier video because maybe the first one works for you. So let's head towards the method guys. First of all, you need to right click on PC and click on manage. So this will open your disk management and select the device manager. After that, you need, you need to click on sound, video and game controllers, you need to double click on it. After that, double click on Connexon Smart Audio HD. So this would open a dialog box and then click on drivers. After clicking on drivers, you need to click the second option that is update driver. So this would ask you two options that is search automatically or if you have the file on your laptop or computer, you can just browse it. But it's better to select the first option that is search automatically for updated driver software so once you click the first option it would automatically search for these uh, drivers if it has an update it would update it and then it would ask you to restart your computer and guys please be patient because this whole process takes about 20 to 25 minutes downloading just depends on your Wi-Fi network but installing this driver takes a lot of time it took me around 20 to 25 minutes to just install the driver but downloading was really super fast. So after restarting your computer, if you head on the start button, you will see two softwares recently added. That is Smart Audio and the Dolby Digital Plus. Voila guys, you have the Dolby Digital Plus on your Windows 10 laptop. So if you click on Dolby Digital Plus, this would open. So this is the Dolby Digital Plus profile editor and you can just easily switch on or switch off this there are <coughs> <coughs> sorry so there are a lot of options for movie for music for game for voice and you have the custom options so sound virtualizer dialogue enhancer volume leveler and all there are a lot there are a lot of them guys a lot so you will just enjoy this if you want to have a demo of this I'll just show you by playing an NCS music. Wait, guys. So this was without the Dolby Digital Plus and now I'll switch it on and now let's see the magic. So guys, after this update, you can just enjoy the depth of the music which you used to get before the Windows 10 update arrived. Thank you guys for watching this video and if you want to uh, watch the first video because maybe the first step, first um, um, method works for you, you can just head on to the description box and I'll post the links down. And if this method worked for you, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel and share this video if possible. Thank you guys.